All right, ask and you shall receive here on Jet Lag Warriors. We are back with another video of the Canadian shopping experience, which is not exactly what Ivana and I set out to do in our travel around the world YouTube channel. <laughs> but two weeks ago, we made a Walmart video, uh -huh. which was surprisingly fun to make, to right. be honest. And the audience quite loved it. So we're back with the iconic Canadian Dollarama. I believe in the States, it's only Dollar Tree. Oh, okay. This is the Canadian version. And this particular location is massive. So let's right. go buy some plastic items made from China. Let's go shopping. Ivana, come check this out. SIM card for $4. Really? Not bad for, for the price. Yeah. Breakfast of champions, born and raised. This is what you need right before a, right before a big exam, big school day, grade five. Sugar, filled with sugar, coated in sugar. Dude, I'm impressed with the selection of Dollarama. <laughs> Quite nice. Decor. Home decor. Mm -hmm. Beer pong. <laughs> Full beer, beer pong, pong set, 375. Oh gosh, mom. Was this your intention today? No. <laughs> it's never my intention, but it seems to always be the outcome. <laughs> <laughs> All right, first section, kitchen utensils. Now, when Yvonne and I moved in together, something like nine years ago, mm -hmm. we stocked our full kitchen with these things. Uh, to be clear, they all broke within two weeks. <laughs> So we thought we were geniuses. We were buying, you know, all the different things, three bucks, plastic, two bucks, but uh, maybe not the most longevity on some of these items. I think the right approach in these kind of stores is to buy stuff that's going to end up in the garbage anyway. So like a plastic bag, four bucks for the big box. Probably a good deal compared to the name brand stuff and it's not meant to last. Oh, but hold on, they've got real stuff here nowadays. This is a metal container for utensils. 425 pretty solid not bad and this is real betty crocker three bucks i wonder the price of this at walmart it might be more this might be the right deal yeah. Yeah. not bad from the kitchen to the bathroom toilet paper four pack 225 cashmere come on name brand look she looks happy what dollarama <laughs> Bathroom sink? This cannot be real. For five dollars? This is the steal of a lifetime. This has got to be made out of plastic or something. Dude! It's non-metal. Non-metallic. Dude, plastic faucet, five bucks. Five year limited warranty. This might be the deal of a lifetime. <laughs> Mr. Clean Magic Eraser. Buck fifty. Uh oh, just what we need, Ivana. A Star Wars theme cake whisk <laughs> for 75. <laughs> wow, I really think Dollar M has stepped this game up. This is a legitimately looking pretty nice wood broom handle. I should say broom base. Five bucks. <laughs> was this here last time? I think Dollar M was also plastic items before. I don't know, but I think this is one of the like bigger Dollar M. Dude, it's shout out. quite organized. Look at this aisle. It's like pretty clean, no? True fact. It's not messy or anything. I think it's one of the better. And Dollarama. the prices seem good and the quality seems good. Seems yeah. like the value is there. Yeah. Shout out to Dollarama. These are like nice household items, no? Yeah. Like organizing bins for your whatever, magazines or newspapers or something? Right, right. Very nice. For 25 for a basket. This is four bucks? I'm surprised. Might, I did not expect this from Dollarama. Might be 10 in Ikea or more. Sometimes they're too thin. Mm -hmm. but these aren't bad for outside. That's not glass. It, That's plastic, right? Uh, yes. Okay, okay, okay. But you'd feel like it's it's not bad. It's eh? pretty solid for plastic. What's the price on that good, glass there? Good quality. On the bottom, $2. $2. Not bad. Get this. this is good for around the pool. We have a... Uh, you have a pool in the backyard, so it's good for around the uh, Yeah, your pool. mom wasn't even planning on buying these. But Dollarama just makes you buy more than you need. You do, it does. <laughs> That's why we got a cart. <laughs> <laughs> we got a shopping cart at the dollar store. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Two pack of popcorn holders. Dollar twenty-five. It'll cost you more for the popcorn, no? <laughs> yeah. What is this? Oh, for soup and stuff. Like oh, mental box. Thermal box. Yeah. For bringing your lunch to work if you're a construction worker. Five bucks. Can't go wrong. Pretty good. Made in China. Of course. I think most of the stuff are made in China. Yeah, almost but. everything. 
It looks good. It's yeah, good. solid. Heart's getting full already. <laughs> 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 You want to come check this out? SIM card for four dollars. Really? Tell me what I'm missing. There's got to be no gigs or something. Bring your own phone. How does this work? It doesn't say anything for a. SIM card for four bucks. I think you have to also pay extra to get the minutes on it. Yeah, here you go. Uh, four bucks for the card. Fifteen bucks a month for hundred minutes and a quarter of a gig. Wow, that's, that's kind of expensive. Well, it's not very useful. A quarter of a gig, but if you're like a senior or something, not bad for. For the price or there's original my favorite candy oh maple flavor yes two bucks put it in the cart <laughs> it's made in canada i love this oh check it out chocolate loony chocolate loony so this is a one dollar coin in canada yes it's got a loon on it so we call it a loony well, we still use uh, it. you can buy what is that seven coins for a dollar twenty five dollar twenty five oh this chocolate. is good stuff it's very good chocolate chocolate and Acai and blueberry inside, 250. 250. Quite good. Found a toonie. It's a massive toonie right there. Giant Dude, toonie. where else are you gonna find a two dollar coin for 150? Yes. In that's Canada. like that's like printing money right there. Oh, yeah. A toonie <laughs> for 150. Buy them and sell them. We call the two dollars coin toonie. Toonie. One dollar loony in Canada. Yep. Dude, check it out. World's longest twizzlers. Oh. Two foot twizzlers. <laughs> It's a good item, no? Yeah. You can peel it all the way. You peel it all the way down. Very long. Extra long. Four dollars fifty. I like them actually. They're good. <laughs> I got excited <laughs> seeing this. Imagine that a four-year-old girl seeing this. <laughs> Cotton candy. Oh my gosh. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> one thing at a time. Oh, it's eight. It's eight in one. Oh, this is supposed to be giant. one thing you gotta lick somehow. Okay, not bad. Eight in one lollipop, pretty cool. I used to love them. They're quite yummy. Banana yeah. marshmallow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And actually, the food places at Dollarama are usually pretty good for the yeah. snacks chocolate bars, chips, stuff like that. 2 $2.25. And two bucks for yeah. the cotton candy. Okay. Not bad. Starburst, Skittles, or Jolly Rancher? Which uh, one? For me, uh -huh. I would go Jolly Rancher. Oh, Skittles, come on. It's the rainbow, man. <laughs> heck yes or heck no coffee mugs. Five bucks. And it comes with two mugs inside. So really, 2 50 each. <laughs> Not bad. And even more like themed and really nice looking mugs. This could be, if it was at like a camping site in a Canadian national park, this would be 25 bucks. Yes. And it would say like uh, a Gonquin or something. Yeah. Dollarama? 2.25. Wow. Dude, that is a steal. This is a good quality, solid ceramic mug with cabin life on it, 2.25. Pretty nice, impressive. That's a steal, hold on. Is this real? Dried mangoes for two bucks? This is a good item, no? Wow. Not. Ingredients, mango, sugar, citric acid. Yeah, this is real mangoes. Two bucks. Put in the cart. <laughs> the chip selection is actually cheaper than Walmart or the grocery store, but it's all no-name chips. So two bucks a bag over here, but the name brand is still going to be three bucks. Oh, 2 I think it's uh, 25 cents cheaper than Walmart. Oh, it's a smaller bag. This is a bit of a trick. I think it's the same price for Doritos. Walmart to Dollarama. I'm really surprised by the selection here at Dollarama. You've got pots for your plants, maybe your indoor tree or something. Four bucks. How's it feeling? Does it feel cheap in your hands or feel solid? It feels good, right? I think if you went to like a florist and bought one of those, it'd be 24 bucks, not four. Coconut water next to the carpets. Coconut water and carpets. For your front door? Yeah, true. <laughs> this is the stuff, though. It's incredibly cheap. Okay, $4.50 for a rug. But when you feel in your hands, it feels super cheap. Mm -hmm. This is the kind of things, honestly, that we've been to Airbnbs that look really nice in the photos. And you get there, and everything is this quality. <laughs> and you know they just decorated it recently, and they're trying to save money. So, amazing deal. I mean, imagine a carpet for $4. But it falls apart in two weeks. Uh, do you remember... 
Wow. Walmart. Uh, was it the same price at Walmart? Dollar fifty. Yeah, cheaper, cheaper. Anything is cheaper, cheaper here. here? Yeah, it's cheaper here. I think it was two dollars. Dollar ninety five at Walmart. Mm. And then you have your no name. Two for dollar fifty. Two for dollar fifty, and probably not that much worse. I mean, how could you make it worse than craft dinner? Yeah, I, I. It's it's as cheap as it could possibly be already, in terms of quality of ingredients. You can also have your instant mashed potatoes. This one is oh. two twenty five. Wait, wait, wait. You have to add potatoes, right? No. It's already there. <laughs> that's gross. Just add water. Oh, that's yes, gross. That's Just add water. <laughs> no, that's too much for me. I prefer my mashed potatoes to involve potatoes. <laughs> it has dried potatoes. <laughs> I understand it says made with real potatoes, but that's something new. Mashed potatoes for $2.25. <laughs> oh. Oh. Kimchi and pho. Instant pho and instant ramen. So uh, no. craft dinner was 150, instant pho 125. How about instant ramen? Also 125. I'm not sure about these ones though. <laughs> Trust the brand names, instant noodles. <laughs> Fair. Two oven mitts with a Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse theme. Five bucks. Quite good. Breakfast of champions, born and raised. This is what you need right before a right before a big exam, big school day, grade five. Sugar filled with sugar, coated in sugar. How much for pop tarts? That was a treat. Steven. I was born and raised daily eater, daily eater, mom. Guys, no, we did eat healthy <laughs> sometimes. Pop tarts would be a treat. <laughs> Normal breakfast, mom, was cereal. Yes, it was. Cereal. There's the there's a breakfast cereal, born and raised. Look at this. Oat fiber helps lower cholesterol. Honey nut Cheerio. This is better. You're a Fruit Loops family. Oh, oh yeah. Ivana, I always, I should have known the day I met you. You're a Fruit Loops family. <gasps> Honey nut Cheerio oh family. Only way to be. Both two fifty. This Reese's. is crazy. This is crazy. This Peanut is just like butter. eating chocolate for breakfast. Oh, this is, even so my family good. has lines, Ivana. That, that crosses the line. <laughs> <laughs> Guess the first one. Guess the first one. That one. You won't believe it. Five bucks. Cheaper. What? How much? Dollar twenty-five. Whoa. To be clear, this is just dark plastic. There's no, no UV protection. Okay. If you look at the sun, you will squint. It's <laughs> not like a UV sunglass plastic. But Looks good though. Probably scratches. It matches somewhere. your jacket. You look cool. <laughs> oh, we probably found a fancy one. Oh, these are the mirror mirror lenses as well. Yeah. Two bucks for I the fancy I think this is for a partying at yeah. night, going to the club. You know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the Hallmark selection of cards. Wow. A dollar each for a card. Very nice. Easter's coming. Oh my god. <laughs> I think your niece would like that. I think it's a winding, winding up. Uh, <laughs> four bucks. Yeah, fair. Kids toys. <laughs> wow. Oh, All the stuffed this? animals. Oh, Very cute. <laughs> how much is that one? Four dollars. Oh. Very cool. Oh, it's so cute. It is cute. Addy would love it. Mm -hmm. Very cute. My mom has been looking for some souvenirs mm -hmm. for people like Abang Ajib and oh, Farrell in Malaysia. That's a good one. Good souvenir. Yeah. The trouble is, it costs $4. Uh-huh. And I think if you give this to someone as a gift, oh. they open it up, they're going to feel the cheapness. No. <laughs> they will splurge for a more than $4 <laughs> shirt. True. Or Everybody if you... Some ideas, remember? If you put it on the laundry, it will last probably yeah, two washes. Two washes and it's going to be ruined. <laughs> but at first glance, a $4 shirt is a deal. Yeah, pretty good deal. That. All the Canadian souvenirs. souvenirs. Oh, this is not bad. This would be actually a good thing, I think. What's this is that? a bottle opener. Oh, that's pretty good. Solid metal. A dollar. Dollar fifty. 50. Looks like it's pretty good quality. Yeah. And keychain. Dollar fifty. Good gift, actually. For electronics. Look at this. You can get headphones. What? For four dollars. 
quantify. Four dollar headphones? Yeah. I mean, I mean, if these things are reliable, this is the best deal in the whole store. <laughs> I think they'll break pretty quick though, less than a month. I think, no, 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 I think in the first two weeks, you're gonna be down to one headphone. It's gonna be the right one works, left one doesn't work. Yeah, And then two weeks so. later, they both don't work. Yes. This is the nature of shopping at a dollar store. You've gotta take the responsibility to make sure if it's good or not. Yeah. So if you go to a name brand store, you have an expectation everything's reliable. Yeah. Dollar store, it's hit or miss. True. <laughs> it's hit That's or miss. True. Four dollar headphones, blow my mind. <laughs> From light bulbs to power cables. A bit power of a home cables. improvement section here. Which I think has some good deals. Crazy blue 250. Oh. Extension cord 475. This is a cheesy extension cord though, it might break. <laughs> tape. Good painter's tape, four bucks. Four dollars fifty cents hammer. Wow. This must be not a good hammer. A real carpenter, which I am not, but a real carpenter would have like a hundred dollar hammer, I think. Yeah, I think so. Fifty dollars at least. Four dollars fifty cents hammer. I mean, I think this is just to put like a photo on the wall, and that would work. You know what I mean? Well, as long as it doesn't break, how do you break a hammer? It can't really break. You just wax up with it. Yeah. This is a good option. Look at this. Four dollars fifty cents hammer. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, no. Okay, Ivana, hold on. We started off in the kitchen section. We went to the bathroom section. We did some food, home repair, and now we're into winter clothes. By the way, not a bad looking hat. Yeah, it says Canada. What's the price on that bad boy? I think it's uh, $3.25. For $3.25. Oh, the trouble is with the fabric stuff, uh, it's gonna be bad quick, you know? The quality could be low on the fabric stuff. But still, $3 winter hat with a design, not bad. Oh my gosh, mom. Was this your intention today? No. <laughs> it's never my intention. But it seemed to always be the outcome. <laughs> Do you like shopping? No. Do you like shopping? Yeah. Yes, okay. I do not like shopping. When I shop, I buy because I'm not a looker. Ah, uh, not a browser. I am uh, I am not a browser. Some people just go window shopping. Ivana. Ivana would love to browse and just try look at it. <laughs> no. Notice the fashion <laughs> trends. Your mother said things about her grandkids. These are all for her grandkids. Oh, that's it's good, Mom. Easter coming. You're yeah. a good Nana, Mom. I'm going to keep them entertained. You're a good Nana. I'm going to put out some Easter decorations, so that's all. <laughs> I really did not expect to see fishing equipment, lures and hooks and bait at Dollarama. Not to mention dog food, or dog toys I should say, like chew toys. Three bucks, 250. So one analysis is, oh my gosh, the prices are so good. But for me, I'm saying the selection is unbelievable. Dog food, $1.75, a whole wall of it. <laughs> I did not expect that at the dollar store. Ivana's amazed by the shampoos, but for me, all I see is Caipirinha! Caipirinha! <laughs> Head and shoulders shampoo at Shoppers is like $11. Here's like five. It's amazing that's the same brand. If it was a, if it was a fake brand of, of dandruff shampoo, okay, I understand the price difference. But to be Head and Shoulders for half the price, uh, it makes me think that it's fake. It would have to be real. It would be super illegal to sell fake with the label on it. Yeah. So, yeah, there's some real value in Dollarama. Oh, for five bucks. Axe for 450. <laughs> Shout out to Dollarama, dude. I'm impressed. <laughs> Hold on. I think my whole life has been a lie. These are name brand Jameson vitamins. Could it be cheaper vitamins? Four bucks for 25 caps? They're still good. I thought it would be expired or something. <laughs> expired vitamins? No! Real vitamins for cheaper than the yeah, pharmacy. Yeah, very nice. Reusable Easter decoration. Mm -hmm. For the table, for dinner. Four bucks. Yeah, I think that's, that's, it's kind of cute. Yeah. Very cute. So the arts and crafts section, where everything seems to be wood, leads into the wooden decoration section. By the way, the best smelling aisle in the store. Scent of fresh wood in the air. Mom's rules, if you want breakfast in bed, sleep in the kitchen. Awesome. Five bucks, can't go wrong. Dude, I'm impressed with the selection at Dollarama. <laughs> Quite Home nice. Decor. Home decor and nice items. I mean, look at this little, little interesting box with a metal clasp on the front. Put something in there. 
four bucks. <laughs> Just nice. Picture frame? $5. Five bucks. Woven baskets, four seventy-five. Very cool. And dangling lamp. Also four seventy-five. <laughs> Scientific calculator. Four dollars. <laughs> Planetarium. Toy on a stand for our kid. Five bucks. <laughs> Mom, I think we should buy this game. It's called Relative Insanity. You can pick your nose, but you can't pick your family. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy runs in the family. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's funny. And only four twenty-five. <laughs> oh yes, whoopee cushion. Two twenty-five. Oh, 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 silly nose, buck 25. What could be better than that? <laughs> Pretty cool. It's like a little hockey arena. Pinball hockey or something like that. They call it flick hockey. Two bucks, can't go wrong. Nice item. Evidently, we have reached the school supply section in a store that seemingly has everything. At least a little bit of everything. Ask for what you want and be prepared to get it. Very nice. I like this. Nice, nice journal. journal. They have a pretty nice one. For $4 each. I'm not lazy. I'm on energy saving mode. Love it. Oh my gosh. They got wedding stuff. The man, the groom, the legend. Woohoo. Wow. How much? $4.50. $4.50. Slightly Very more cool. expensive than the Canada t shirt. Oh. Oh my gosh, shirt. They even got. Bridal, bridal veil. veil. Three, Three bucks. bucks. I feel like I feel like a bridal veil is not a dollar store item. No, it looks cheap, to <laughs> be honest, cheap. that one. Three bucks though, can't go wrong. <laughs> Gosh, this brings back elementary school memories. This is the elementary school project. Right? First thing you get is the Bristol board. Any color you want, and then you stick on your pictures and your posters and a uh, dollar a pop. Oh my gosh, let's buy a couple packs. Oh my gosh, take the phone. I'm busy. <laughs> Are you gonna buy? This is real Pokemon cards. Four cards for $1.25. It's a good deal. <laughs> I was getting a starter back was like six bucks. Wow. We should save our money all month for Pokemon cards. <laughs> oh, look at this. Three premium cards for $2.50. <sighs> they're so they're so smart with the packaging, you can't see what's inside. Get this a wall of all your party needs, party even needs. the candles, birthday candles, a dollar, a dollar. <laughs> full beer, beer pong set, three seventy five. Cool, Good item, man. Good item. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so cute. Oh. I'm assuming this is not genuine Barbie. No. You're looking at five bucks for a doll. Isn't Barbie like fifty bucks for a doll? I think so. This is Barbie's. Uh, I used to Cut love Barbie's. Sister. <laughs> Her hair might fall off in one week. Yeah, yeah you're gonna have a bald Barbie in yeah. two week. <laughs> <laughs> Good one though. Very nice. I'll tell you what, there's like seven or eight rows to this store. Mm -hmm. Every row is a different section. Right. Very well organized. Yes. Very clean, friendly staff. Good experience in Dollarama. <laughs> yeah, true. I was impressed. <laughs> I was thinking, really? I'm doing a video in Dollarama? It was nice. Yeah, I haven't been here for so long. I found stuff that True. I wouldn't th think that I would find here. So. Perfect. And next, um, we're going to go to Bulk Barn. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if Bulk Barn is still functioning in the same way it was before. Right. COVID rules. But another very discount, interesting store. Okay, let's I'm having go. fun in these shopping videos. I never enjoyed <laughs> shopping until I made a video shopping. But here you go. You're so funny. Next stop, Bulk Barn. Bulk Barn. Right, introducing Bulk Barn, where you can buy nuts and tea and coffee and spice and everything nice. And they're still doing it in the big bins where you can scoop it. I was worried it would be canceled for COVID, but uh, every candy under the sun, including but not limited to juicy tea gummies. <laughs> what? If I were a younger man, I would take this out of the bin, 
and I would put it in my mouth <laughs> and smile. <laughs> but the idea is you grab a bag and you scoop like this. Yeah. Uh, fill up your bags and you weigh them at the front. And yeah. Per kilo. Or per kilo, yeah. And, and this uh, one is 159 per 100 gram. All of your favorite candies. Wow. Wine gums, sour keys, sour wine gums, Double bubbles, dumb balls. <laughs> Everything. You name it, they got it. Mm. Uh, top store for school children. True. And bakers. And bakers. True. No further, everybody. The ultimate snack. Peanut brittle. Mm. Uh, they're, called, they're called OMGs. Peanut butter pretzel clusters. And good price, too. 372, 100 grams. Oh my gosh, I can go for 500 grams of that. Even when you open it up, the smell comes wafting out. Peanut butter and pretzel. Yeah. Mm, so good. Oof. Dark chocolate graham clustered with almonds and toffee. OMG. Oh, the smell is so good. Ooh. Chocolate covered ginger. Ooh. That might be for you, Ivana. You like ginger, no? I do. Me, ginger is no. Hold on. Pause. Chocolate covered cherries. Bro. May contain cherry pits. 351, 100 grams. Oh my gosh, that looks wow. good. Oh my really? gosh. I will admit, I've never real tried cherry? a chocolate covered cherry with real cherries inside. Oh. Could be nice. I've never tried before. Actually, I'd be curious to know what a bag of pretzel costs at the grocery store. Over here, it's 81 cents, 100 grams. How much is a normal bag of pretzels? Like 400 grams? Probably about the same price. Three bucks or 320 for 400 grams. Maybe about the same. What are you buying, Mom? Slivered almonds. Uh, right here. Two seventy-five, one hundred grams, for your uh, my, beans and slivered almonds. For my for, salad. For my salad with the clementine oranges, yes. red mm. onion, that's a good salad. Poppy seed dressing. Got it. Okay, so this is the cooking section. For example. Ah, uh, light brown molding wafers. This is for melting and making into like a dessert, like a fondue or something like that. Belgian milk chocolate melting wafers. That would be a nice thing to pop in your mouth and suck on. As well as, uh, oh, peanut butter chips. Ooh, so good. I've never seen that before. Cookie. That would be good to put in cookies. You could put chocolate chip cookie, you could put peanut butter chip cookie. I didn't know that was a real thing. Uh, and of course, baking powder, stevia, sugar, etc., etc., for all your baking needs. Dude, fun shop to browse in. Bulk yeah. barn. Nice. Hey, dates. Very common food to uh, break your fast in Ramadan. Yeah. 77 cents, 100 grams. Let me know if that's competitive price compared to where you guys are from. To be honest, I have no idea the regular price of dates in any country. <laughs> yeah. I've never bought a date. Uh, depends on the I've never bought a date, but I did have a very nice date with you, Ivana. Oh. First date. <laughs> Ooh, something new. This is butter. sort of like a homemade peanut butter, cashew butter, white buttercream icing, sunflower seed butter, hazelnut butter. By the way, smells so good. Oh my gosh. So the idea is you would put it in a bag. No, you put it in a cup like this. Yeah. And you'd fill up with uh, some homemade butter. Or locally made butter, at the very least. For, uh, looks like it. Almost looks like dosage, right? And also honey. Honey amber, white. Interesting concept. I bet you it's probably cheaper here than the name brand butter. I, I mean so. peanut butter, like craft peanut butter yeah. versus bulk barn peanut butter. Probably yeah, cheaper here. I think so. That's my guess. Hey, tapioca, flour, starch. So is this the big tapioca, or is this the um? The or fine like powder one. They made from soybean milk or tapioca. What? Maybe from cassava. I think it's the wrong sticker. Yeah, I think so. This is the one that's for. This is the one like flour that's made for fondicajo. Yeah. The one that looks more watery or, or clumpy yes. is the one that's for tapioca. Yeah. Capiche. Cap I used to have my favorite almond cookies here, but they don't have it anymore. They were already made cookies? Yes. In a big tub? Yeah. And you put them in a bag? Yeah. Darn. Yeah. I'll tell you what, we can buy all the ingredients, we can make them ourselves. Wow, all oh, the hot chocolate. Tickle me blue raspberry. Drink crystals, okay? Turmeric latte. A little bit of everything in this store. Yeah, and all uh, sprinkles and spices. Quite beautiful, right? Mm -hmm. 
Oh, check it out. You can buy your coffee and grind it right here. And they've got all different varieties and mixes of coffee. And this section naturally smells so good. Yeah. And it's funny, this is sort of like a market or a bazaar we've been to in other countries. <laughs> true. I always thought Canada had no bazaars or markets. Well, it's not technically a bazaar. But it sort of is. Yeah. The bulk barn is the Canadian bazaar, <laughs> isn't it? Self-serve, yeah. Self-serve bazaar. <laughs> right. Oh, something new. Macaroni and cheese sauce. Mom, you should buy a couple hundred grams of this. And then when we make craft dinner, we can add in our own macaroni and cheese sauce. Make it, make it double cheese. This is a good idea. Dude, two bucks for a hundred grams. And look at the color of it. Oh, yummy. Be honest, guys. Does that look good to you? Fake cheese. Yes. I'm surprised cheese isn't in quotes. Like, cheese. <laughs> So we decided on the honey mustard pretzel bites, non-GMO, mind you. <laughs> Cheers. Who you tried before? Uh, Maybe, yeah. <laughs> Good. <laughs> and the o OMG. Mm. This is the best one. No, it's not. We could use. To, we could have used a drink. What's this one? Oh. Peanut butter and chocolate. Chocolate, oh, peanut, peanut butter, butter, butter and, and pretzel. pretzel. Mm. <laughs> okay, I'll take this one. <laughs> there you have it. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. Had, you had fun shopping today, huh? <gasps> Me too. Shopping with my two favorite ladies. Oh. oh. Okay. All right. And See you, Mom. the ending? Don't be shy. <laughs> Later, skater. <laughs>